tonight we have our year-end show. It's called Spring Spirit. So it's where uh, the recreational kids and the competitive kids sort of come together. It's like a gala performance. They perform for their parents what they've been working on all year. So we have a mid-year performance that happened in February and this is sort of like the culmination of everything that's happened before then and since then. Well, this also serves as sort of a, a nice memorial um, for Christina Rock, who was a close friend of mine and a fellow coach and gymnast. Uh, we knew each other for years and this is a really nice venue for us to um, perform in her honor. We've got awards happening for her tonight as well and her family will be here too. So this is a nice way for all of us to sort of be together. It's going to be a lot of beautiful tributes. These are girls that Christina has been coaching since they were, you know, five, six years old, and they're now, you know, 20. So they've also grown up with Christina, and um, so it's really nice for everybody to able to sort of just express their love and uh, gratitude to her tonight uh, through a few different routines that sort of have different focuses, um, you know, either on being strong and um, you know continuing to grow together, and then also just remembering and reflecting on uh, what we had and how, you know, she's still here with us. Um, Christina, she was um, like a true inspiration to everyone. And um, she really motivated everyone. <laughs> she like inspired everyone to always try their best. <laughs> and to always like work their hardest. Everything we did. Whenever uh, I was down or feeling really upset, she would always make me feel well, like at home or happy and ready, like ready to do gymnastics and always excited. How long was she your coach? Eight years. Eight years. Um, what would you say was the biggest lesson you learned from her? Um, the biggest lesson was probably not giving up on anything we try to do. There's no better story, really. She like was undergoing treatment and planning kids' camps, and she was sick. And she, but she was in the gym always, up until she physically could not do it anymore. The last practice we had was in January, and she passed at the beginning of March. So she was here until she couldn't anymore. So I think that that's something that really like speaks to the kind of person that she was.